Hey, what's up guys? It's LD coming back with another unboxing and review video. But before we get to the shoe itself, I do want to let y'all know why it is that I call myself Lord Diaz. So, big shout out to my fiance for hooking it up with the Lord title. And here it is. As y'all can see, it comes with the little folder and it just says Lord titles, literally. And I'm going to go ahead and show y'all the certificate. And here it is. So this is why I call myself Lord Diaz. And if y'all want to read through that real quick. But anyway, that's it with that. But let's get to the shoe, guys. So before I made this video, I went ahead and uploaded another video that is kind of like part one to this video, sort of. But yeah, let's get to it. So again, we have another Adidas box. And here we have the Tubular Doom. Basically, it's the tonal ones, the all pink ones, or if you want to call it triple pink, triple pink. And again, this shoe released in other countries before it even released here. And I got this off Adidas.com. And let's get to it, guys. Bam, there it is. One shoe. Let me go ahead and take out the other one. And this, this shoe came with like a lot of paper. I think it was because or it is because the color like goes to other fabrics and I'm assuming they didn't want the color transferring to another fabric but it's the same color shoe so I don't think that would be too big of an issue but anyway guys here it is all pink um, my initial thoughts is that the shoe is pretty dope like I said on the black one I had kind of low standards for the for these two pairs of shoes, but they just look amazing. Like the quality of the suede is just really good. And we have suede. Y'all could tell the difference of the colors. Like the black is kind of hard to tell simply because it's all black. But right here you can tell the difference between the suede and the actual fabric part of the shoe. And the laces is like pretty much um, the same as the fabric. But anyway, we have um, suede in the toe box as well as the little cage that holds the, the shoelaces. And then we have a strap that runs through the whole back. I'm not sure if this will be considered a pull strap. Um, I don't know, I guess it could be. I'm not too sure about that. And then the suede, like I said, um, it's a really good quality suede. Um, and the black shoe was kind of hard to tell, but there is a difference of, of like, I guess you could say roughness in regards to the suede, this back part, which is the one that's probably more prone to getting dirty. Um, is kind of, it feels like a little rougher, so I guess it's a little bit more resistant as well as water resistant. And, and then this one on the little cage, it's just a little bit softer, but I do see a little little stain here already so it's probably gonna be a hard shoe to keep clean but you know with crap and all that stuff it's not impossible but anyway the sole the signature tubular sole with the adidas branding right here and then we have the straps here and as well as underneath the shoelaces and then the sock part of the shoe which basically again is gonna hug your ankle it's going to give it a little tight feel, but that's just how the shoe is. And, well, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. I'm going to show you all the other one, which is obviously the same thing, except this one has that tag saying that some color um, may transfer to other fabrics. Um, but anyway, here's the shoe. Um, let me get you all thoughts, y'all's opinions. I do want to go ahead and, and show it the black shoe side by side, just so y'all can see which shoe looks better in y'all's opinion. And yeah, so here it is, black and the pink. Um, I mean, I like the pink. I do have some pink um, CX Fluxes, but I think I'm just gonna go ahead and keep the black one. Or I might just keep both, but the black one is probably my favorite from both of them. Here, let me show you all the back. 
but again with summer coming up the pink one's probably going to be a better option in regards to like the season but i mean don't get me wrong they're both pretty dope shoes and they retail for like here let me double check i don't remember i think like one 150 or 140 i'm not too sure but it wasn't like they were 140 yeah they were 140 so the price is not that bad but anyway guys here's here's the shoes and if y'all like the video as always give me the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel thank you